right guys i hope you're all okay today i thought i'd sit down and film a beauty favorites which i feel is very old school very much like what's in my bag um which i'm here for i love those types of videos so i thought i'd sit down and film one today um i know loads of you are here from my old beauty days which i love and appreciate um but yeah i'm hoping that some of you will enjoy me taking you through some of my favorite beauty products I've got about 12 products here so I'm going to get stuck straight in, um, starting with these two little Neom oils. I don't know if this is really beauty, is it? Yeah, I guess it is well-being. These are the Neom Organics um, Essential Oil Blends. I use these downstairs in my Neom Pod, um, which is basically like a, an oil infuser. The house smells so good when I use these. I absolutely love them, but they are they're finished now i use them a lot in lockdown here i've got the de-stress one which is lavender jasmine and brazilian rosewood and then the sleep which is um english lavender sweet basil and jasmine these are my two favorites which is why they have finished um i've had them for ages though i think you only need like how many does it say five to ten drops um mixed in with water uh, but they're so good i'm gonna repurchase these for sure they come in a set of four i think i think you can buy them individually but I'll just buy the set. I really love them a lot. Um, I think you can use them in the bath too if you don't have an infuser. Um, so I recommend them. Next up I have a cleansing oil. This is the Bobbi Brown Soothing Cleansing Oil. And as you can see, I have only got the tiniest amount left in this bottle. I've gone through a fair few of these. Um, I've been using it for what seems like years. It is the one thing that I love to take all of my makeup off. It's just I feel like it's a gentle product but it does such a good job of just melting everything down eye makeup eyeliner it just it just works so nicely um obviously i don't use this as like a proper cleanser just to remove my makeup um but it's really really nice inside it's got jasmine flower white water lily and goji berry extract um and yeah it's just a dream to use so yeah recommend that if that's the kind of product that you're on the market for at the moment um, I know there's tons of alternatives. I started using one from a different brand entirely, um, which is nice so far, but I feel like this is just, this is my classic um, go-to. So yeah, recommend that if you, you're on the market for cleansing oil. Something that's gotten me through all of the hot days that we've had recently, and I promise I'm not going to talk about the heat too much because how British, um, but it is this Elemis Pro Collagen Rose Hydro Mist. It's just a mist, not just a mist, it's a mist. Um, it's just really nice. I've also been using the Clinique Moisture Surge, I think, but the bottle is slightly bigger. This is just nice for me to chuck into my bag and carry on with my day. It's just a nice something to give your skin a little bit of hydration, cool you down in the heat. Um, I actually had something very similar to this in both of my bags when I was giving birth, um, which was lovely. So yeah, this is the Elemis one. Smells delightful just a nice product next up i have a fragrance now i'm not the biggest perfume wearer i would say um i've got a few favorites which i do dip in and out of um but i've never really been one that wears perfume every single day purely because i suffer with headaches quite badly um and i always worry that that will like trigger a migraine or something but a perfume that i really do love is estee lauder bronze goddess um i will very rarely ask for like a perfume for christmas or birthdays and things like that um but i did this year and i asked for another bottle of my bronze goddess they bring this out every year um and i've loved it every year in terms of how it smells it smells like holiday it's just got that coconut vanilla -y sun lotion smell and seeing as we've not really been able to go on holiday this year this has just been my little like holiday in a bottle and it's so so nice i've only actually got one makeup product here but that is the it cosmetics your skin but better cc plus cream i love this stuff as you can see i've used quite a lot of it if you're looking for something that feels kind of light on the skin and looks light on the skin but is full coverage give this a go i've seen a million positive reviews of this online i've also seen a couple of people that haven't got on with it so well so of course beauty is all personal preference but i really like this this is a shade medium tan 
I had tried a sample of the medium shade, which I did prefer, but they didn't have it in stock. So I feel like it's a bit of a popular one. Um, but I really love it. It's what I wear on my skin most days at the moment. Um, I love that it. it comes with like a little pump applicator. It's just really nice. Um, I'm going to repurchase it when this is finished, which is looking like it's going to be finished soon. Um, but yeah, if you are on the market for something that is full coverage but feels feels lighter on the skin which is nice for summer um then give it a go i have a moisturizer here that i've been using for about two and a half weeks now which normally i wouldn't ever talk about skincare after two weeks because i don't feel like i'd have enough enough of an experience with it to really give you like a proper review um however i love this stuff this is the elemis superfood glow priming moisturizer um i've spoken about it on my insta stories i really like it um, it's been compared to one of the Glossier products, um, but not as intense. She has such a nice glow to the skin. Um, I've been wearing this alone, just as like a moisturiser when I'm not wearing makeup, and underneath. And it just, it just does what it says. This gives your skin a really, really nice glow to it. I'm all about the glow. I love highlighters and anything glowy that I can put underneath my base that will come through. And this does just that. I really love it i wish the bottle was a little bit bigger um but yeah i'm a big fan a product that i've been using a lot in the bath and the shower recently is the beauty pie soul providers re-energizing dry oil sugar scrub um it smells so good oh my gosh honestly it smells so nice i feel like this is my favorite kind of body scent um it's got a grapefruit black pepper essential oils lemon peel sea salt and evening primrose is so good beauty pie is a brand that i really love at the moment i've been subscribed to their like service for about three or four months um so of course i've been making the most of it and buying my allocated spend if you don't know what beauty pie is basically beauty pie go to i, I think this is how it works i think they go to the manufacturers and the factories and things that create amazing products um but they cut out like the middleman and they basically they take the product repackage it and then sell it to us at the price that it should be sold for um as opposed to like mega money that brands put on top of product um and then we pay like a subscription every month to kind of pay for their overheads and things i guess um to allow them to be able to do it so i i think i only do the five pound a month option um, and that normally allows me to buy like two products products that I, I mean I've not been disappointed with any of them at the moment I've just dipped into a couple of the makeup products um but the skincare I really love I've got two things here um but yeah maybe I can do a whole thing on my beauty pie collection but I'm a fan so far um I'll let you know how I get on with more things as we go on i'm sure but yeah this is really really nice now i'm normally a bit funny about oils because i do fake tan so much but i've been using this a lot just because we've kind of been stuck at home um and it's very 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 nice whilst i'm talking beauty pie i'm gonna mention the um super pore detox purifying black clay mask this stuff is so good i feel like this would be my number one recommendation for beauty pie if you do want to try it this has got glycolic lactic and salicylic acids inside it which i love i love an acid on my skin i'm all for like a pill pad and exfoliating toners i use them pretty much every day but this has got it inside it and it is such a good clay mask um i've used a lot of this there's not actually that much left so i'm going to order one on my next month with beauty pie um but yeah this is such a good product i love it a lot i actually think this is probably probably my number one favorite of all of my favorites this month final three things i have here are all hair products um my hair looks a state today it needs a wash but alas let's continue um i've got a shampoo and conditioner here i'm cheating a little bit i'm going to just use that as like one product this is a purology hydrate shampoo um this is for dry color treated hair i'm pretty sure this is vegan yeah it is 100 vegan 
I've been using these as my current main shampoo. I say main shampoo because I use a lot of like purple shampoos and things. Well, a lot. I use it once or twice a week. Probably once. Maybe twice. Um, a week. But these are like the main shampoo I use. The hair always feels so nice after using them. And it smells so nice. It's almost like a menthol. Like quite cooling on your hair which is nice um how many times do i say nice it's actually ridiculous um but yeah for color treated hair i love these and because i have got color treated hair i've been using olaplex recently it took me a while to buy into olaplex i was like really is it gonna be that good <sighs> it's amazing it's really expensive but it's really really good these were i think 26 pounds each um, and when they arrived in the post, like, after I ordered them, I was like, why are they so small? They really are quite tiny, but they've lasted a fair time. I've definitely got more of the number six left than the number three. So number three, um, I put on, when, you're meant to put it on like 10 minutes before you wash your hair at least. It's not a treatment, it's just, it just fixes like the cuticles, I think, in your hair and makes that cuticle stronger. Um, and then number six is the bond smoother so you put it in your hair once you've washed your hair and you're about to dry it and it just fixes your hair that end and um, so it says here concentrated leave-in smoothing cream excellent for all hair types including colored and chemically treated reduces frizz and flies away for up to 72 hours um i love this stuff i wish it was cheaper i really do um i might splurge and buy a big bottle next time because I can't see me ever not using this or while I've got blonde in my hair anyway. Um, I really love it. And then the last hair product I have here is the Way Memory Mist. I talk about this all the time on my stories, maybe in my vlogs when I'm curling my hair. Um, I love this stuff. My hair's quite fine. Admittedly, since I had it bleached, it does hold a curl better. I don't know what that says about my hair. Um, but it doesn't really ever hold a style unless I use this. This stuff is magic. It smells nice. I, I love a lot of the Way range anyway. Um, but the Memory Mist is lovely. You kind of just spray it all over your hair before you curl it or style whatever style you do. Um, and it just helps to hold it. I've tried so many of those kind of products in the past. Some of them have worked, some of them haven't. This always does. I think I've repurchased this. I think this is like the third time now um this one's pretty full but yeah i love this product loads of you always ask on instagram what i use to curl my hair most of the time it's the mark hill pick and mix small curling wand um but always with this always always um i'm a big fan so that was my current beauty favorites i have got loads though so if you would like another beauty favorites maybe next month let me know and i'll do that because i've got quite the array of beauty products um these just happen to be my favorites at the minute um so yeah thank you for watching i hope you're well let me know what your favorite beauty products are at the moment in the comments um give me a thumbs up if you have enjoyed it subscribe if you're not subscribed already and i'll see you guys very very soon <laughs> bye